Look at that, guys. What's up guys, welcome back. We missed you. Um, I just got off of work right now and um, today's my Friday. So it's Monday, but it's my Friday because I don't work on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. So um, Angelique's taking a shower right now. We just got back from the store. We bought some alcohol for cocktails tonight because it's Friday, my Friday. And then um, I got something even more exciting. We just bought this air fryer right here. It's a Kasori air fryer. We're gonna give it a try and see how it works. I was really excited, so we had to go to the store just to get this pork belly. Um, we're going to uh, start it off in the water and boil it and cook it for probably about an hour. And then we're gonna pop it into this air fryer and make lechon kawale. So, yeah, today for lunch we had corned beef and rice. So I'm gonna put these away. And we will get started. Okay. So what I'm gonna do to season this is I'm going to put some bay leaves. Since we're making lechon kawale, I'm gonna put some bay leaves in there. Put about four bay leaves. And then we're gonna do peppercorns. Peppercorns and soy sauce. So uh, what boiling this water does right here, um, we're gonna uh, cook the pork in there and by boiling it, you're basically getting the pork all tender. So by the time it's ready to be taken out and put in the air fryer, the pork will be already getting tender. So then when we fry it in the air fryer, it's only gonna crisp up and get super crispy on the outside. And we'll get that chicharron on the outside of this, this pork right here. So uh, the outside will be super crispy and the inside will be nice, juicy, and tender. So it's not gonna be too chewy because otherwise this, this cut of meat right here can be kind of chewy if you don't uh, cook it right. So we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and simmer this pork belly into this pot of water. For probably about an hour. So um, we'll go ahead and uh, probably get some cocktails started and uh, I think I'm gonna make a drink for Angelique because she's in the shower right now. So um, yeah. Who's here? Hi, baby. <laughs> so what, what else do we get right there? What do you have in your hands, baby? Um, cider, apple cider. Before any of you guys give me a hard time and say this is a girl's drink, <laughs> just remember, this is for the asawa, okay? So sometimes she drinks what I wanna drink and sometimes I drink what she wants to drink. We gotta switch it up sometimes. Right, baby? She loves these apple cider things right here. Hey babe, yeah. are, you, are you excited for the Lechon Kawali? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm pretty excited for this air fryer, guys. My God, look at it. Looks so pretty. All right, so I got, I got my cocktail ready. Hmm. All right, guys, so we got this Kasori air fryer. It's the new model that just came out. 
It has uh, a smartphone uh, function to it where you can actually control the temp and control cooking times or even start it or stop it all from the power of your cell phone. So it looks like it's got an LED display and this is the 5.8 quart, the large air fryer and it's got a touch screen display. So yeah, oh, we got the bonus one. Uh, so we got this on Amazon and this particular one comes with this uh, kebab uh, wire rack and kebab like sticks. So you can make air fried uh, kebabs. So yeah, let's go take a look. Angelique just unboxed it over here. So just need to take off all the stickers here. I'm already picking up the plastics inside. So. Okay, so all the plastics are out of there. And there's that tray, the kebab tray, with the sticks and everything. That, that's pretty cool because I could see us making like, like maybe barbecue Filipino porks and stuff like that. Yeah, so given the, given the nature of this thing, this thing I would imagine gets really hot. So one of the important things that you have to do is make sure you take off all of the stickers because otherwise you're going to get uh, some burnt plastic smells, I would imagine. Um, but yeah, this it looks pretty nice. This top part's got like a like a textured surface, so I think that's cool because it won't leave as much fingerprints, especially if your hands are oily. That's pretty cool. And this is the yeah, this is the touch screen right here. So let's go plug. Go ahead and plug it in, baby. Oh, there's instruction on the back. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, go ahead and plug it in. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Okay, so we have the user manual here, and it's pretty cool to set up your phone right off the bat. They make it easy. They got um, a little scan code right there. You could scan your Kasori thing. And then it's gonna bring up the uh, place where you can register it and uh, download the application, I guess. So this is the home for the app. And then it says, add your first device. So okay. we're gonna add small kitchen appliances. And then it's right there. Oh, it automatically the, detects yeah. it, huh? Smart air. Product. Nice. Okay. Next. Add device. Hello while using the app. Okay. And look for the air fryer right there. There it is. Perfect. All right, we're connected to the network and now it's activating our device. That's pretty cool. So uh, you you have to connect to it like a Wi-Fi network. Oh, that, look that beep right there. So I think that beep means that we connected, huh? Because look, the, the little Wi-Fi symbol right there disappeared or nuts it's still there but it's not blinking anymore it was blinking before successfully connected successfully connected guys okay so looks like we're successfully connected okay let's go ahead and update the firmware on it make sure everything's up to date make sure all the latest software is on there so I see here that there's a bunch of different symbols I guess you could bake a cake there's bread a broccoli they have bacon, fish, steak, chicken. They have a bunch of different settings right here that you can do. But um, that's if um, you know you don't know what temperature to cook certain items at. Um, I have a good idea of what we're gonna be cooking it at. So um, what I'm gonna do right now is just to clean out the, the, the air fryer. They recommend that you do this upon getting the device because there might be some residual like chemicals or plastics inside there. Um, so what we're gonna do, let's see here, temp. Let's start that at, let's go for 30 minutes. And then we'll do the temperature to the highest it can go, which is 400 degrees. Um, and then you press play and that's gonna start it. These things have a fan built into them because what it's, what's going on is the heating element is on the top of the machine um, and it's pointing down into this basket. So it's pointing down into this basket and it's forcing air into there. 
and that air is hitting that heating element so it's blowing hot air all over your food and that's what's crisping it um so it is gonna make a little bit of noise but it's really not that loud and from what i hear uh, other uh, people that have tried this out this is actually pretty quiet in comparison to other air fryers that are out there so um, we're gonna go ahead and let it do its cleaning cycle and kind of let it warm up and when we're uh, when the pork's done um, we'll be back and guys so the pork is ready so um, what we did was we cooked it for about an hour and a half uh, on a low to medium simmer and what that did is it made the pork all tender so it's real tender right now and now what we're doing is we're poking holes in the top with a fork and what that's gonna do is it's gonna uh, help crisp up the skin on top Okay, go ahead and add some salt all over it, baby. Put it on the bottom first. Put some salt on the bottom. Make sure you add it like all over. All the oil is coming out of the, the pork now. So we're gonna get some salt on it. So let's go ahead and put this in. Or you could put it in right here. I like that you can take this thing out and carry it around. That way, um, you create less mess. Let's go ahead and put it in. Okay, so let's hit the on button. And I'll say, let's put it, let's put the temperature at 380 and time. Yeah, I say we'll do 15 minutes. We'll see what the pork looks like after 15 minutes and decide if we need to put it in there for a little bit longer because um, I haven't used this before so it's our first time so yeah let's go ahead and give this a try the pork is ready guys all right you hear that thing popped up the fans spinning it's ready to go I'm excited So go ahead and open it. Let's take a look and see what it looks like after 15 minutes. Oh, yep, it's starting to crisp up. Wow. It actually looks pretty good right now. Look at that, guys. Wow, it's set up. <laughs> so I think uh, another 15 minutes and it should be good. Okay. Hey, babe, I think you're running low on drink over there. I, I, need, I need to get her a uh, apple cider. So, if you guys don't know what these are, these apple cider um, beers, they're like, um, they're, would you would you say they're similar to the Sam Mig apple? No. The Sam Mig apple's not sweet like this? Or the Sam Mig apple sweeter? Um, that's sweeter. No, Less? The Sam Mig apple is sweeter. Is sweeter? Okay. So Sam Mc Apple is a little sweeter than this, I guess. So let's get Angelique her drink. <laughs> Baby. Baby. Take a drink. Take a drink. Take a drink. It is ready, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> I need you over here. I don't want to be guilty here if I burnt it. Open it now. Wow. Look at that, guys. Oh my god. This thing is crispy. Let's listen, let's listen to it real quick.
I think it passes the sound test. All right, baby, I'm gonna let you decide the condiments. What are we gonna put? I want my mom to make. Mangtomi? Yeah, you still have the soy sauce for me. Yeah, get the soy sauce for me. Are you gonna eat rice? No. No carbs. Even though rice is life, I think we're just gonna stick with the mangtomi and pork by itself with that. Soy sauce sauce that we made earlier. All right, Angelique's gonna take the first bite. I think that maybe we made it maybe a little bit too tender, huh? What do you think? Yeah, it's too tender. Yeah, I think next time, because we cooked it for a total of an hour and a half, so I think next time we'll just do it in one hour. It's piping hot. But yeah. I don't know if I'll wait or what. <laughs> Super hot. Wow, I heard that crunch. Mm. It hurt your tooth? <laughs> My gut. Mm. Good? Oh yeah. It's mm. nice. Is it restaurant quality? Mm-hmm. It is. Look at this guys. Just look at that right there. This Lechon Cavalli looks amazing. Angelique even agrees, and she's a Filipina. I love wow. it. You love it? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Take a bite of the skin. Get your skin off, and, and I want to see you chew it. Oh, that's crispy, huh? Mm -hmm. Wow. All right, guys, it's my turn now. Just take a look. Look at that. Pork. All right. Let's give it a try. I'm gonna do this. Soy sauce? I'm just stealing your Hmm? Wow. Try it with the mas. Try it with some of this meat. You got the perfect bite. You got the perfect bite right there, guys. Got a little bit of meat. Some of the skin right there. Now we're gonna do the mang tomas. Mang tomas. <laughs> Mm. You know, there's just something about roasted pork like this. When the skin gets all crispy and the fat renders out, it's just amazing. And the smell, it's like so buttery, crunchy, salty, porky goodness. What do you think? Mm, I feel like eating rice. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's a good bite right there. All right, guys. So um, we're going to enjoy the rest of our pork belly. We don't want to talk anymore. We just want to eat. So um, if you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, uh, follow our Instagram. And if you guys like that air fryer, we bought it on Amazon. We'll put a link down below. Um, it's actually a pretty good price. Uh, only $100. Yeah, so, it's pretty cheap. Yeah. Um, air fryer. Yeah, and the air fryer, I was actually really surprised because we tried to cook it not too long ago in the oven and it didn't come out too good. <laughs> it, it actually got burnt. So the air fryer cooked it just perfectly. It's uh, super crisp on the outside. 
I think next time we'll just uh, boil it just a little bit less because it was too, too, too tender. tender. Yeah. yeah, too tender. Just a little bit less, it'll be perfect. Um, so yeah, um, we'll see you guys next time. Bye.